So I'm going to be critiquing how I used to train the fly spray. So we're going to whip out some fly spray with Winslow. Again, Winslow's a pretty chill horse. He's not super worried about most things just naturally. Not Definitely not because of any of my training. Probably in spite of it. But I want to kind of run through this and show you how I used to do it. So we usually start kind of next to the horse. Um, really, I should not be just directly spraying on him because a lot of for a lot of horses that's too much um, and you'll see that in Piper specifically if you look up Piper's videos Appaloosa she did not like that at all um, I had to have to think of other horses but Winslow's pretty chill so most of the time this is not a training video this is okay Winslow's cool with this he's either naturally fine with this or he's had this done in the past and he doesn't care or he's pretty tired and he just doesn't care it could be a combination of some of those so I would definitely not start out by just spraying him on the shoulder. For a lot of horses, that's way too much. You're going to push them over thresholds. So um, if you watch my Mustang videos of how I taught them with positive reinforcement, that is how I would do it now. But um, yeah, right now he kind of lifted his head up. He doesn't really like it there. So at this time, like I was told, you keep spraying until he lowers his head again. That, that could really send a lot of horses into definitely a lot of fear. They could start moving a lot. So that doesn't work for a lot of horses. Um, it worked for him at this point, but again, he has all those factors kind of beforehand. So what I would definitely change about this is starting to spray away from him. So like not just on his shoulders, completely away from him, then progressively working closer, then actually spraying him. So this is with just me getting lucky. This isn't a how-to video, you know, it's just, okay, well, he tolerates the spray, so he lets me spray him. You know, that, that's not training, that's just, he happens to be good at this. So, which I think is um, a lot of training that you see. It's like, okay, well, this horse happens to be good-minded or he's cool with this. Like, you know, that doesn't help everybody else who has an issue with it. Like my first horse was terrified of fly spray. This would have never worked with her. I tried it. She would just run circles or run and run and run and run. And she would just go, she would go forever. So that doesn't necessarily work. You got to break it down and do it in little tiny steps and build their confidence, not just make them hold still until you get it done.